a four point sequence xn is one two three four has d of dx of k k is in between zero to three without performing d of t or id of t find signal values which has d of t x of k minus one now we write here according to circular frequency shifting property according to circular frequency shifting property so n into e raised to minus j 2 pi pi n it is d f t x of k plus l that is x of k minus l now here is equal to 1 now let the signal whose dft x of minus l is denoted by x1 of l the signal whose dft is x of k minus 1 is denoted by x1 of n so x1 of n is equal to x of l e raised to minus j 2 pi 1 n by 4 since n is equal to 4 in this case now given sequence given is that x of n is equal to 1 2 3 4 <coughs> so x of 0 is 1 x of 1, x of 2 and x of 3 values are here. Now find the sequence. Find sequence x1 of n as follows. So for n is equal to 0, x of 0 is equal to n to e raised to 0 is equal to 1. Now next is for n is equal to 1. So it is 2 cos pi by 2 minus j sin pi by 2. So x1 of 1 is equal to sorry minus 2 j now next is n is equal to 2 minus j 4 pi by 4 so it is 3 e raised to minus j pi so it is 3 into cos of pi minus j sin pi so that is equal to minus 3 this is the value of x1 of 2. Next is n is equal to 3. So x1 of 3, x of 3 e raised to minus j 6 pi by 4. So it is 4 e raised to minus j 3 pi by 2. So we can write it is 4 into cos of 3 pi by 2 minus j sin. 3 pi by 2 so it is 4 j which is x1 of 3 we can write so x1 of n is equal to 1 minus 2 j minus 3 4 j dft of sequence xn is given by this xk is equal to 4 1 plus 2 j j minus 1 minus 3 j using dft property only find the dft of this which is xn is the complex conjugate of so according to complex conjugate property we write here according to according to complex conjugate property if x of n is is d f t x of k 
then dft minus k of n now we have what we have we have x of k is equal to d1 square that is 4 1 plus 2 j j1 minus 3 j this is given sequence so we can write of k is equal to 4 1 minus 2 j minus j 1 plus 3 j but we have to write here but dft of this complex conjugate is minus k n here this complex conjugate of minus k of n indicate circular folding what it indicate it indicates circular folding of x of k that is complex conjugate of x of k that is sequence complex conjugate minus k of n is obtained by plotting the samples plotting the samples of complex conjugate of k in clockwise direction in clockwise direction so we can write complex conjugate of minus k is 4 1 plus 3 j minus j 1 minus 2 j this is dft find the response of a fire filter with impulse response hn 1 to 4 to the input sequence xn 1 2 using circular convolution problem was asked in university exam for the four mark now first is given what is given uh, step one it that it is x of n is equal to 1 and 2 and h of n is equal to 1 2 4 this is given now l is equal to 2 m is equal to 3 and n is equal to l plus m minus 1 that is 4 so x of n is equal to this sequence is 4 points it is 0 and hn is 1 2 4 0 as n is equal to 4 now next is step 2 step 2 is x of k is equal to this 4 matrix this is 4 by 4 matrix so x of k is it is minus j minus 1 j minus 1 1 minus 1 j minus 1 minus j into x of n is it's 1 2 0 0 so we solve this and 1 plus 2 1 minus 2 j 1 minus 2 and 1 plus 2 j so we can write x of k is equal to plus 2 is 3 1 minus 2 j it is minus 1 and it is this is 1 plus 2 j similarly h of k is equal to so it is minus j minus 1 1 minus 1 1 minus 1 and here it is 
सॉरी प्लस छ माइनस वन माइनस छ इन टू दिस मैट्रिक्स इज वन टू फोर जीरो सो बाय सॉल्विंग वी गेट सेवन माइनस थ्री माइनस टू छ थ्री एंड माइनस थ्री प्लस टू छ सो वी कैन राइट दिस एज एक्स ऑफ के इज इक्वल टू सॉरी एच ऑफ के इज इक्वल टू सेवन माइनस थ्री माइनस टू छ थ्री एंड माइनस थ्री प्लस टू जे दिस इज द सिक्वेंस फॉर एक्स ऑफ के नाउ नेक्स्ट इज स्टेप नेक्स्ट इज स्टेप थ्री नाउ वाई ऑफ के इज इक्वल टू एक्स ऑफ के इन टू एच ऑफ के सो वी मल्टीप्लाय अबाउट टू सिक्वेंस एंड वी गेट ट्वेंटी वन माइनस सेवन प्लस फोर जे माइनस थ्री माइनस सेवन Now next is step four. Now y of n is equal to one by n complex conjugate. So we can write y of n is equal to one by four. One 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 one. Here j. माइनस वन माइनस छ माइनस वन वन माइनस वन माइनस छ माइनस वन वन सो वी कैन राइट इन टू वाई ऑफ एन इज ट्वेंटी वन माइनस सेवन प्लस फोर छ माइनस थ्री एंड माइनस सेवन माइनस फोर जी सो वी सॉल्व दिस एंड बाय सॉल्विंग यू गेट वन बाय फोर इन टू फोर सिक्सटीन थर्टी टू 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 So, sequence for y of n is one four eight eight. This is the sequence for y of n. Next, consider a finite length sequence x n, which is given, and from that y n is a sequence related to x of n such that equation of y of k is given, where x k is a eight point d of t. Then obtain y of n. Also obtain the finite length sequence q of n, which is related to x n such that eight point d of t is given by this equation. So first is first part of the problem. So first we write here q one. What is q one? Y of k. Y of k is equal to it is eight point d of t. Eight point d. So it is four k x of k. This is given. Now, according to circular time shifting property, according to circular time shifting property, we can write x of n minus l. D F T circular shifting property. We can write k. This is second part. So compare the equation one and two. Compare equation one and two. By comparing equation one and two. We can write y of n is equal to x of n minus four. That means y n represent the circular value of sequence x n by the four samples. That is y n represent circular value. 
circular relay of sequence of sequence x of n by four samples by four samples so we can draw this so this is the diagram for the y and um, for the uh, delay by four sequence so we can write y of n is equal to zero zero this is the starting point of y of n zero zero one one four three two one now second part of the problem now what is given given is q of k is equal to r e of x of k this is equation third now consider let x of k is equal to m of k plus j n of k this is equation fourth now m of k represent the real part so it is m of k minus j n of k adding equation 4 and 5 add equations 4 and 5 so equation is x of k plus 2 m of k so we can write m of k is equal to complex conjugate of this divided by 2 this is equation 6 now taking IDFD take IDFD inverse transform on both sides so we can write M, we can write M of N is equal to X of N K is converted into N divided by 2 this is equation 7 as minus n d f d what we have to write here we have x of n is 4 3 2 1 double 0 1 1 this is equation 8 this is what we have and its complex conjugate is 4 3 2 1 same 0 0 1 1 now what it represent it represent circular folding it represent circular folding of Yeah, and for that we have to draw the figure so this diagram shows the circular folding of xn now we can write x of minus n it is 4 1 1 0 0 1 2 3 now put equation 8 and 9 in 7 so we can find the sequence m of n now for n is equal to 0 m of 0 is x of 0 plus divided by 2 so 4 plus 4 divided by 2 it is 4 so in this way we find all the values for n equal to 1 2 3 to 7 so we here we directly write m of 1 is equal to 2 and we have to solve this and then find out these values it is 3 by 2 m of 3 is half m of 4 is 0 m of 5 half m of 6 3 by 2 and m of 7 is 2 so we can write the sequence for m of n as of n as 
फोर टू थ्री बाय टू वन बाय टू जीरो हाफ थ्री बाय टू एंड टू दिस इज द सिक्वेंस फॉर एम ऑफ एन थैंक यू